Many individuals say the no-fap impacts of better hair and skin are fake treatment, be that as it may, would they say they are true, there are many individuals who guarantee that their hairs are becoming quicker and thicker than at any other time. I'm additionally getting this advantage of semen maintenance. Going bald for men is a significant issue, and a great deal of men are beginning to encounter this at more youthful ages, a few men are thinning up top in their 20s, a portion of the primary driver of thinning up top is abundance levels of pressure and dietary insufficiency. I need to impart to you a touch of the Chinese medication point of view on the issue of going bald. Going bald is caused, as per Chinese medication by insufficiency of zinc. Zinc is an indispensable mineral and our actual quintessence, it's our center energy. It is identified with sexual liquids and to chemical levels. We are brought into the world with a plenitude of zinc, and afterward we truly choose how we need to spend this zinc, our center energy. This is the reason, when we were youngsters we were so dynamic and delicious, we have this wealth of zinc, yet as we age, all that we do is spending zinc, we are eating undesirable food utilizing drugs and psychoactive substances, we are not working out, we are not getting sufficient rest, we are exhausted and focused, these things exhaust your zinc, another large method to exhaust our zinc is over discharging, this is one of the fundamental ways that men lose their zinc, you can get things done to get more zinc in your life, rehearsing certain types of kegel exercises, taking certain spices and eating certain food varieties can help. At the point when you're inadequate in zinc, when you're lacking in actual quintessence, the hair begins to thin, it begins to dark, and begins to drop out, you begin to bear. And organically this bodes well, since when a man is continually discharging, it takes such a lot of assets for the body to make sperm. Sperm is this force to be reckoned with of supplements of minerals, and the body puts the best that it has into the sperm, you're losing zinc, you're losing energy, you're losing supplements, you're losing energy on such countless levels from discharging, and as you do this again and again you realize the body can't stay aware of this creation of semen, and it needs to pull assets from everything. Semen, the fluid that comes out of your penis when you come or ejaculate, is high in protein. So one theory is that each time you ejaculate, your body is losing protein, which you need for hair growth. It pull assets from the organs from the spinal liquid, it's putting this on making more sperm and pulling on its assets, so it can presently don't bear to place its assets into making new hair, so it stops. Your hair begins to dim, begins to drop out, this is identified with zinc insufficiency and unnecessary discharge. Masturbation definitely causes hair loss. I personally tried not masturbating for 9 days in a row, and I could see, not even one hair on my bed sheet. As soon as I broke the streak and did it a couple of times, I could see dozens of hair falling. At the point when you begin rehearsing semen retention, you stop this channel of your zinc. I've had men tell me that they were thinning up top or their hair was beginning to thin and they began rehearsing semen maintenance, they quit discharging continually and their hair began to regrow, it got thicker it got better they restored their ordinary hairline. Another theory is that masturbation increases your levels of the sex hormone testosterone which in turn raises your levels of a hormone linked to hair loss, dehydrotestosterone, DHT. In case you're stressed over thinning up top, or on the off chance that you are encountering going bald, I feel that saving your semen is perhaps the best venture that you can make for your well-being imperativeness and your lifespan. At the point when you take a gender at hair, one of the capacities it has is to drawing the other gender, it's an indication of the fruitfulness of sexual imperativeness, that you have a solid working conceptive framework, you have an excess of this energy and you can develop this delicious, vivid, full head of hair. Intentionally we see somebody, and they have sound hair, we decipher them as being appealing in light of the fact, that their body is revealing to us that they're fruitful, that they have this sexual imperativeness and you can't have that on the off chance. That you are discarding the entirety of your essentialness, and depleting the entirety of your zinc. By rehearsing semen maintenance, the body's done staying at work past 40 hours to make this new semen, so we discharge this energy into different things and you have considerably more energy, substantially more imperativeness in your body and you'll have a lot better head of hair, it is smarter to make the mindful before it's past the point of no return, in the event that you cannot go one semen maintenance for a month at any rate. Attempt it for multi-week, yet don't jerk off day by day it will suck your energy and leave you numb. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe the channel and share the video with your bald friends. Have a nice day.